Though the Ghana government as an entity would have responded to the report debunking its findings, opposition leader Barrett Jack Dio bashed the head of state for being silent on the matter. Take responsibility. He is like Pontius Pilate. Everything is... This guy is in charge of this government the last time I checked. The last time I check, he's still the president of Ghana. He takes responsibility for nothing, absolutely nothing. And he is in charge. And his own report said he approved this deal. That is his report saying that he approved it now. The cabinet. Who he, which he chairs. International Corruption Watchdog Global Witness found that the 2016 oil deal, which was negotiated by the current administration, could cause Guyana to lose billions, that there were conflicts of interests at play, and that the country's negotiating team ignored expert advice. Jack Dio, in responding to government's claims, argued that the PPPC did not influence the Global Witness report. They were busy touting this international organization as being great. But when other credible international organizations have, uh, for example, this to say, like this report that we saw, the damning report, suddenly they're not to be believed or they're PP, PP, from the PPP. Well, let me say, the People's Progressive Party did not bring Global Witness here. We have no such power over Global Witness, which is an international NGO. He posited that the revelations from the report warrant an investigation. Rupa Sinarain, The Evening News.